Well, we uh, we made it to our next spot. It's already looking like better mule deer country. Oh, for sure. Um, it was about a two and a half hour drive from where we were. We're now uh, just south of the small town of Chadra, Nebraska. Uh, we're in the Nebraska National Forest right now. Uh, we got a we got camp set up. Uh, it's about two o'clock. We've got about three three and a half hours of uh, daylight. daylight left. Um, we are for sure in mountain time zone now, so we don't have to worry about wondering what time it is. So, also, quick weather update. Um, it is probably about 30 degrees warmer here. It's a solid almost 60 degrees out right now. Um, no gloves. <laughs> no gloves. We both shed, uh, multiple layers. No wind. No wind. Uh, weather's looking pretty good the next couple days as well. Um, so hopefully, uh, hopefully we've got some better luck. good sit in spot to glass for a while this evening. Levi uh, just spotted his first wildlife of the trip. <laughs> There's a coyote probably about a thousand yards across the oh at least it was by a mile. The range here. I think we're uh I think we're just gonna sit here for the evening and see what comes out and figure out a game plan for in the morning. So far this area looks a lot more promising than the last we've yeah. seen a lot more deer sign than what we did uh, it just looks deery too in the last place so hopefully we've got a good sunset coming in and we're gonna chill out here for the night well day four um Saw two white tails on the way in this morning. Not a last night other than the coyote, and today's gonna be a long day. Lots of hiking. Get back in about what? Probably two mile, three mile, somewhere in there. It's gonna be a good day. Quiet this morning. Uh, only got down to about maybe high 30s last night. Uh, it's, it's gonna get back up into the 50s again today. So should be a should be a good day to put some miles on. Okay. Well, deer spotted. No clue what it is. Buck or doe. Making a move. Pretty stoked. That uh, would be the first deer that Levi spotted in or while hunting all week. So I'm pretty proud of the kid. He's uh he's growing up pretty quick. Oh, turned out to be about four or five doe. Uh, they're probably still several hundred yards away. Too far for the cameras to pick up. I didn't even see him. Levi's been watching him for probably about ten minutes now. It's about eight a.m.
been sitting here in this location for probably about 30 minutes. The wind has picked up substantially. Uh, the wind is setting right there in that tree. Uh, he's overlooking this. I'm overlooking this area to the south. So I think the temperature's dropped a little bit. But we haven't seen any deer yet since those ones this morning. So hopefully things pick up here. Just bumped uh, three white tailed doe. Pretty sure they're the same ones from this morning. So Levi's tag is actually for a white tail buck or a mule deer buck. There you go. So at this point, we're looking for anything with horns. Yes, we are. It's about noon. Second to last day. Yep. So still a little windy. Hopefully that clears up for this afternoon. Two o'clock, sitting in this place for probably about half an hour. Picked up a fairly large coyote when we got here. Um, we're gonna start making our way back to the car. It's about a two mile walk if we went straight, but we'll probably make it three or four miles. So, no more deer yet. Uh, hopefully things change this afternoon. about quarter to four probably have about hour and a half maybe a daylight left we're posted up uh, in a spot overlooking the nice valley and hillside here for the evening um, didn't see anything on the walk here it's probably about a mile and a half maybe two miles from where we were earlier so hopefully something wanders out in here tonight morning of last day five last day here it's actually christmas eve today um hopefully we have some
Christmas luck this morning. It's warm. It's yeah, about the same temperature as yesterday. Um, I think we're just going to hunt the morning and we might pack up and work our way home. We're both pretty tired and uh, feet hurt. We put on a lot of miles this week. So here goes a good morning hunt. nine o'clock last day here in Nebraska we're uh, just sat over a big opening here for about half an hour we're gonna get walking again work our way uh, the long way back to the vehicle for the morning so Quick update. We uh, we were on our we were in the car heading back to camp and decided last minute to turn up a forest road that we had been watching. Thought about going up yesterday but didn't. So we turned up the forest road, we got about a mile deep, and ran into a herd of probably about a dozen to fifteen mule deer with at least three bucks in it. So we hurried up and got ready. And we're, uh, we're trapping them down right now. So they took off pretty quick, but we're gonna work our way towards them. Probably a decent three by three. Yeah. I have they had fun. Yeah, a lot of miles. Yeah. Well, we put on about. Parking, you mean? Yeah, I think we put about nine on yesterday. And the day before, I don't know how many of that was. And then. Okay. Dear, dear, dear. All right, we caught up to them. Finally spotted them again. They're about a mile away from us already. Nice little three by three in them. Yeah, a couple, couple smaller bucks in there. I don't think we're gonna pursue them because they're just too far away now. Gone. Um, and they'll hear us and probably see us and hear us come and smell us from. Oh dear. Quite a ways away. White tail. Yep, we got two deer off to our right. Well, we've been sitting here for probably, what, five minutes maybe. And we saw that herd of 12. There's more than 12, I think. Well, maybe 14. 15 in there. And plus, we've seen three whitetails sitting here already. All doe. All doe. 
It's kind of frustrating that it's the last day and we're now just getting on the deer. In a matter of 20 minutes. Yeah, we've seen more deer in the last 20 minutes than we have all week combined. Which is a good thing, it's nice, but at the same time, we were both uh, we were both planning on packing up and heading out of here today. So I'm not sure what we're going to do now. But we're almost back to the car here. Decided not to pursue them, they're too far away. And uh, I think we got some other plans this afternoon, so. Well, we're back at the campground now. The uh, We decided not to pursue those, those deer that we ran into. Uh, like I said, we by the time we caught up to them and found them again, they were probably a mile away, so we didn't even, didn't even think about it. Uh, we're going to get packed up here, rip the tent down, sort the, sort the cars out and uh get on our way levi any final thoughts it's been a long week a lot of miles little deer how you feel about western hunting it's a challenge a lot of a challenge lots of walking lots of glassing legs are sore backs tired all of the above we're heading to Mount Rushmore, so if you wanna, you wanna tag along, check out the next video.